guys, we're going to do a nail polish review. Now, I hauled this from the Dollar Tree the other day. If you saw that video, then you saw me say that we were going to do this, and it may just be a hot mess. I don't know. I'm going to shake it up really well. This looks like just plain black and white nail polish, but it looks like little specks of maybe newspaper torn up and in a bottle. So it looked interesting and I wanted to try it. So I've had this a couple of days and just now felt like trying to do a video and getting it out. So this is an OPI nail lacquer um, polish and let's see. It is called I'll Cancel You In and there's not any other identifying marks just OPI I'll Cancel You In black and white nail polish. So now I'm going to attempt in my big camera experience here to pan down and hopefully the camera will stay there. Let me move it back just a tad because I want you to be able to see it. Maybe we'll do it. Oh yeah, okay. So let's do it here on top of this box. I want to get close enough for you guys to see what I'm doing. Yeah, that should be it. Okay. So, as you guys know, we've been having camera problems. We've got a new camera on the way. So, I'm trying to review some videos back here that we finally did post. It's just taken me all day. It's 1045 at night. And so, I've been trying to post two vlogs like part one and part two from today on YouTube and they just now post it okay okay so this is going to be one of those kind of nail polishes that you have to build up huh it's kind of like my wet and wild um that I'm so crazy about that pink color where you have to build it up. But once you get it on, it's really, really pretty. So, let me go over this one more time and then I'll hold my hand up and then we'll kind of, I'll do the other hand and let this dry and we'll start building it up. Maybe I won't have to keep you too long. We'll put it on pause. So this is all Tinsel UN OPI and we've not really started building it up yet. Let's go do this other hand right fast and then I'll put you on pause and while this is drying a few minutes then I'll put on the second coat and we'll just kind of keep pausing until we can get it to look like something and I'll tell you how many coats. So really, that was two on the other hand. Like, not very thick, but you know, your normal kind of coats that you put on. So, right now it just looks like I had been spray painting or something and it had stained my hands, but I think maybe once we get a bunch of coats on here, this will be pretty good. So I'm going to let this dry for a minute and then we're going to start building it up. Okay, so this is about five coats of this stuff. I will tinsel you in. Ooh. So I don't know how in focus that actually is. I don't know if I'm going to like this or not because it'll probably take another good four or five coats to make this look like anything. So let's do a couple more and then I'll show you and we'll see what happens. I, I don't know if I'm going to like this in the end or not. Okay, so this is about eight coats and the more you put on the better it looks. So I'm kind of just trying to touch it up where I can see little specks that have gone astray there. 
but this is what you get with all tinsel you in from OPI. It just doesn't, I hope it's not out of focus. It doesn't look like it's really in focus for me on this end. I don't know, maybe it is. Maybe if I get a little bit further out. So this is what it looks like. Eight coats. I may put one more on there, but it's 11 o'clock at night and I want to go to bed at some point, you know. So we're going to maybe finish this up and we'll post it tomorrow, May 2nd. But this is our review of OPI's All Tinsel You In. Eh, you know, it's not my favorite. It's not my least favorite kind of nail polish that I've ever put on. I don't see me taking time to put this 10 coats on every time. Now, for my Wet n Wild, that pink that I like so well, I probably would take the time to do that. And it lasts a pretty good long time. But this, I'm not even sure will last. So this is a, a maybe product. It is OPI, so it is a good brand. But who has the time to do that every time? And then you've still got to touch stuff up. So this is absolutely not my favorite thing. We'll move on to the next color. See you guys next time with another product review. Hopefully next time it'll be a like. I hope that you guys are enjoying the videos. And see, I've already messed that one up. Just turning the camera up, I've messed it up. So I've already got a touch up. We hope you're enjoying the videos and we'll tune in for some more. We're going to do some more cooking segments and I've decided to call that burning down the house. And then of course we try to do the, the vlogs because that's the easiest to do and we do that quite often. And then of course we have our buzz agent reviews, which those are sporadic because you have to be approved for campaigns and they have to send you the stuff and all that. But we will do um, product reviews on things that we think are, that we think, like me and the dogs can and talk to you. But like um, the reviews that we'll do, maybe it's something my mom comes up with, a product that she likes that she wants to talk about and she'll help me. Willa has said that she wants to join in on some videos. And so she's here twice a month. So I'll get her to help me do some product reviews and some arts and crafts and all that kind of stuff. So we got lots of stuff coming up. Okay, so that was one more coat. I'm done. I'm not gonna touch anything else except to turn the camera off and just say good night. See you guys next time.